Good morning, everybody. Today marks October 1st, and today officially begins vlogging. But by the time you guys see this, it won't be October 1st because I actually have two videos that I'm, <laughs> I have coming up before this one. But regardless, this is part of my vlogoween. So, in today's video, I am just woken up from my beauty rest. I just woke up in the morning, have leftover makeup because I did the best job cleaning my face last night. But um, I actually just wanted to come in here and show you guys my transition from my fall decor to my Halloween decor. I loved my fall decor so much. I even told you guys I want to keep this up all year round possibly because it just it's just such a vibe for me. But it is October 1st, so I do want to change my background to be a Halloween theme. I got a lot of my decorations out. I only got a couple of new ones, but I really just want to make it like pretty and Halloween-y. And then we're going to put it back to fall for the month of November for Thanksgiving. Because no one ever like decorates for Thanksgiving, and I love Thanksgiving. And then we're going to transition into Christmas. So with that said, let me just show you guys one last time how our setup looks like. And then we're going to start the transition to Halloween. I'm going to miss you. Let me turn the lights on. Oh, look how pretty. Okay, here is the fall decorations one last time. My babies, I worked so hard on you. Uh, it's time to say goodbye. We are just going to revel in how beautiful the fall decor looks. It's my absolute favorite. I am so sad to see it go, but now it's time to say goodbye, Elmo. No, I'm sorry, <laughs> wrong song, but today also marks Disney's 50th birthday. So um, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and set you guys up. We're gonna start taking everything down. I'm gonna film me putting everything back up. And yeah, I really hope you guys like vlog a week. So I think it's coming out great. I am so excited for you guys to see this. Um, well, you guys just pretty much saw it, but I didn't want to do the same thing I did last year. And last time I had a lot of cobweb over my mirror and as cool as the cobweb is, and I do have it, I may or may not add it. The only problem with it is that it literally is such a pain to work with. Like the cobweb starts to like disintegrate over time and spread out. So I'm not entirely sure. I just, you know what, let me get, let me know your opinions. If you guys think I should put cobweb across the entire mirror like I did last time, let me know in the comments below. But if you think I should leave it the way it is, let me know that as well. But let's go ahead and take a look. So I wanted to go for more of a witch's theme this year. So here are my little potions and spell bottles. 
we have all the candles. They do light up except for this one. Doesn't light up for some reason it's broken, but it is what it is. We have little spells and skulls, a little crystals with my countdown to Halloween. And then right over here, we do have some more spells. And I just love the way that this looks. It's so freaking cute. It's like came together perfectly. Oh my God, I freaking love it. And this is what my room looks like with the lights off. Is that not so freaking gorgeous and so aesthetically pleasing? Ah, I am so in love with how this Halloween background looks. It makes me so freaking happy. I love it. Like, just look at this. All right, well, I hope you guys liked how this turned out. This is probably a really short video um, just because I really just wanted to show you guys my transition from my fall to my Halloween decorations. Last year, it was kind of all over the place. I was never really a big fan of how my Halloween looked back then, but I really wanted to be a little bit more cohesive this time around. I really do love how it turned out, and I'm probably gonna change it up again when it comes to Christmas and not the same thing I did last year either, but I really love how this turns out. It's really getting me in the mood for Halloween. It's getting me in the mood for Vlogoween, and yeah, I'm just really excited. So hopefully you guys like this video. If you do, please make sure you guys give this video a cheeky thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe my channel if you guys have not already said to post every single day in the month of vlogging and uh make sure you guys check out my other channel it's r for life you guys get to see my cool wonderful adventures my amazing husband Corey. and a huge huge thank you to all these beautiful patreon members that you guys see right here thank you guys so much for everything and to my subscribers and viewers thank you guys so much for being here whether you guys like this video you guys thumbs down this video you guys subscribe you guys did not subscribe either way thank you guys so much for being here i love and appreciate each and every single one of you so with that said guys i love you and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video bye